In just a few minutes, family, friends, and people from all over Farmington Hills will be taking part in a special fundraiser for the Cipriano family. 7 Action News reporter Cheryl Choden is at the Farmington Hills YMCA. And Cheryl, what a heartwarming event for this family. Oh, it certainly is, Diana. So many family and friends are here. It is a 5K walk and run. It's going to get started in about an hour. We're at the Farmington Hills Y, and that's because Rose has been a trainer here. There is so much excitement here and a lot of love. Setting up the event has been a labor of love, say the volunteers, who have been working on the 5K run walk for weeks. And in the past few days, they've been working nonstop. They've had a lot of help in the way of donations, food and water and ice, you name it. They did buy the T-shirts, which are purple because it's Rose Cipriano's favorite color. And the butterfly on the front and the saying on the back was designed by Sun Tanner. It is because of the family tragedy, of course, that this is being held. The death of Bob the brutal beating of Rose and son Sal, and the horrific circumstances surrounding the attack in April. The money raised will go to the Cipriano Children's Fund. It's $25 to register, and nearly 1,800 people are expected to take part. We all would like to do something. Right, it's the it's the compelling pull when you care about someone who's been injured, and uh, this has obviously been a terrible tragedy. But events like this give us an opportunity to contribute, to do something for the family, and to just show how much we care. Now, of course, you can take a look behind me. People are starting to gather. They're going to start doing some stretching at 6:30. The actual run walk gets underway at 7. Take a look. You can see white and purple T-shirts. Volunteers wearing purple, like I said in the story, white because the family said they'd like the participants to wear white because that signifies hope. Also, again, all the money raised goes to the Cipriano Children's Fund, and we'll be here. Can't decide if we're going to walk or run. In Farmington Hills, I'm Cheryl Choden. Seven Action News.